All right, Shalom, Akim. Before we get started, as usual, I want to give all praises, glory, and honor to the Heavenly Father and His Son by their true names, Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah by Hashem, Hawa Kakwadash. And double honors to the old apostles of Great Millstone who rule and teach well. And honors and salutations to the Akim of Great Millstone that's pushing his truth throughout the four corners, Shalom. And this video is going to be real quick. Uh, we just going to hit on the topic that uh, you can have multiple wives, all right? You know, multiple wives and concubines, all right? <clears throat> and uh, we're just going to jump to the point, but uh, I'm going to read verse 1. It says, uh, And the Lord Yahweh sent Nathan unto David, and he came unto him and said unto him, There were two men in one city, the one rich and the other poor, all right? <clears throat> and it, uh, it's talking about, you know, David, you know, and uh, the other poor, you know, which is, uh, which about the, uh, Euro, all right? Because, uh, which we're going to read on down here. I don't want to jump the point. But, uh, David had got, uh, Euro, uh, killed in battle, all right? By putting Euro, like, on the, the front line in battle, all right? You know, just like how, uh, you know, uh, you know, you been on the front line, the heat of the battle, and things. You're more likely to, uh, you know, die quicker. You know. Uh, I want to read the precept first, but long story short, uh, you know, uh, David got uh, Ura, you know, killed in battle. All right, all over. Uh, uh, Bear, it was all about uh, Beersheba, you know, because he uh, wanted Beersheba. All right. All right, so Beersheba, she was the wife of uh, Euro, all right, whom David had, uh, you know, got Euro killed in battle, you know. Having, uh, you know, which, you know, that's, uh, he got got him murdered, you know, for his wife, Beersheba, all right, so, and it's going to tell you on down, uh, I'm going to read it right quick first, I don't want to jump the gun, uh, Second Samuel 12 and 7, and Nathan said to David, thou art the man, uh, you know, which is going, you can read the, read the, uh, basically told you from verse 1 all right all right uh and nathan said to david thou art the man thus said the lord uh yahweh of israel i anointed thee king over israel and i delivered thee out of the hand of saul and i gave thee thy master's house and thy master's wives all right plural wives into thy bosom all right you know, David had sex with all, all them women, all right, and gave thee the house of Israel and of Judah, all right, and it, and if that had been too little, I would moreover have given unto thee such and, and such things, you know, plus mo, all right, wherefore hast thou despised the commandment of the Lord, Yahweh, to do evil in his sight, all right, because, uh, you know, David, uh, which that was uh, adultery, all right, you know, which is uh, land with another man's wife, all right, um, thou hast killed Ura, the Hitchite, all right, because, uh, you know, he sent Ura into battle, all right, and put him on the front line, you know, uh, the Hitchite, all right, which Ura, you know, he's an Israelite, but he lived in that land, all right, with the sword, and has taken his wife to be thy wife, and has slain him with the sword of the children of Ammon. All right. Uh, now, therefore, the sword shall never depart from thine house, because thou hast despised me, and has take, taken the wife of Ura the Hitchite to be thy wife. All right, thus saith the Lord Yahweh, behold, I will raise up 
evil against thee out of thine own house, and I will take away thy thy wives before thine eyes, and give them to unto thy neighbor, and he shall lie with thy wives in the sight of, of this son. Alright. So it's it's uh you can have multiple wives, alright, but we're gonna uh you know also speak on you know on these precepts as well. All right. <clears throat> Let me get the precept on David uh son. All right. And that's uh that's a commandment, you know. It say where if thou hast despised the commandment, all right, cause of Yahweh Bashem all right, cause you're not supposed to uh, commit adultery, you know. Let me get this quick precept for you. All right, and uh, this Second Samuel sixteen and twenty-two, all right, this this Absalom uh, David's son, all right. Uh, you know, so they spread Absalom a tent upon the top of the house, and Absalom went in unto his father's concubines in the sight of all Israel, all right, which that's a big no-no, you know, but Absalom had, uh, sex with David's concubines, you know. But the, uh, main point of this video was that you can have multiple wives all right let me get one more uh, precept oh barrel me let me see if I got it on here Here you go. And this is this another uh, precept just proving to you uh, that David had multiple wives. Well, you know, that, that you can have multiple wives, all right? Second uh, Samuel 5 and 13, you know, and David took him more concubines and wives out of Jerusalem after he was come from Hebron, and there were yet sons and daughters born to David. All right. And the, and these be the names of those that were born unto him in Jerusalem: Shemuel and Shabab and Nathan and Solomon. All right. And uh, you know Solomon you know, was chosen of all the David sons, you know, to sit on the throne. Alright. But, uh, I'm gonna st stay on topic. Because you got women, the, the reason why I'm bringing this out, you know, because you got, uh, women out there and you got Jake to this day think you know uh it, you only can have one wife that's Christianity you know that's what Christianity teaches you all right and they uh Christians run to this precept you know it's a uh bishop all right Say uh first Timothy three and two, a bishop then must be blameless, the husband of one wife, vigilant, sober, of good behavior, given to hospitality, apt to teach. It say a bishop, all right. And women not even uh which we can get a few precepts on them. Alright. Well I'm gonna get it in the other uh
get in, I'm gonna get into my sword right quick. Alright, this uh first Timothy three and two on the word bishop. Alright. G nineteen eighty five uh episcopos an overseer, a man's charged with the duty of seeing that things be to be done by others are done rightly. Alright. Like a uh a guardian or a superintendent. Alright. And in these, uh, you know, uh, let me get the piece up. All right. So the scripture is not against having uh, multiple wives. You can have multiple wives. All right. I'm gonna have to shut shut this video down right quick.